Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is NightShadowXO and today's video we're going to be showcasing a Funko Pop. He is called the X-Force Deadpool and he's part of the, the Funko Pop series. And they made a giant Deadpool. I never got to showcase him because stuff happened, really bad stuff happened to me. But this is super exciting because my mother bought me it and it's in mint condition. It's actually the Walmart exclusive 10 inch Deadpools and he's right behind me. Look at this, buddy. Oh my god, look how scary he is. He's the X-Force Deadpool. So the colors on this Deadpool are black and red. Mostly gray because um, he's X-Force Deadpool and he's one of the Deadpools that came. There's two um, red ones. There was a Katana and uh, dual pistols. That was the two red ones. That was uh, $25 at um, um, Walmart exclusive ones. And then they got the blue one. I forgot what the blue one's called, but um, he's a really cool one. All these are 10 inches also. And they also came out with a X-Force Deadpool, the one I'm showcasing in the background. And he's giant. I'm just showing you guys what the comparison Funko Pops in the background over there to the 10-inch Deadpool X-Force. <laughs> he has dual-wheel katanas, and I'm going to show you guys in a minute here. The thing I was saying about the X-Force Deadpool, he is a Walmart exclusive, and he's a 10-inch. He's one of the biggest out of the Deadpool series, and they released a bunch of them. Also, they released a golden version of Deadpool 2, and I also got that. If you guys want me to do a showcase video of that, um, a subscriber got me it, and he wants to say anonymous, but uh, thank you so much to him. I'm going to say like thank you to to him two times in uh, both of these videos but he did not buy me this my mom bought me this one and uh, you guys bought me the other one so I'm quite happy about it uh, so this is what he looks like this this is the front of him perfect it, it's this mint and if you guys are wondering how much he is he's about probably a hundred or more on eBay he's going for and he's probably worth more now because he's from the Walmart exclusive uh. so here's the Deadpool he's really cool he has dual wheel katanas he's a 10 inch just like the other ones and he's part of the collection I'm not sure if they show no they do not show him on the back but this is uh, just one of them and just shows how big this Deadpool is and he's the 543 series that's the back these are the sides uh, 543 and uh, me and my mother at the time uh, we picked it up at Walmart and she wanted to go with me at um, when they, they were selling these I forgot when they were selling these I think during Black Friday and um, yeah the only at Walmart exclusive there it is there is his face he has red eyes and just to get a closer uh, scene with this so you can see his boots, he has um, some other things to hold, other uh, objects, or uh, like probably like whatever he carries, <laughs> whatever this Deadpool carries. I'm not sure if they're all different or they're just different uh, camos for each other, but you can see the dual wheel katanas, and they did a quite nice job on the katanas, and they're really, really cool. And you can see there's a symbol of Deadpool, and has a crossed out sign, and uh... And there's the Deadpool's face, all red, giant, gray, black, and red. And um, he is quite insane looking. There's the side of him. You can see there has more katana on the other side too. And just like that. Um, I'm not sure what his back looks like. I'm not going to be opening this sadly because how uh, expensive this guy is. And I don't want to waste... Uh, people's money for opening it to be honest I want to collect this anyways but my background just turned more uh, reddish a little bit I think that's telling me something but that's the other side pretty much the back of your guys already saw and um, there is the top pretty cool and the bottom is just a generic uh, Funko Pop bow down just to let you guys know, um, the Deadpool series, I'm not sure if all the Deadpools are like that. If you guys see under him, he has like a spring under his head. And he actually, um, his head actually bobbles. <laughs> Just to let you guys know, that's a little cool feature you guys, if you guys don't want to open this and want to know that. Anyways, and my, uh, I seen one of my friends have a Deadpool and it has just 
a spring just like that on his smaller Deadpool. So I'm pretty sure they added a feature to like um, jiggle the head of the Deadpool because uh, it's pretty cool. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below what you guys think about this Deadpool. If you guys want me to showcase the gold one, let me know. And um, when I got him at Black Friday, I'm pretty sure I got him by Black Friday. Um, 25 bucks, but now he's worth about 50 to to $100 or more. Um, it's crazy. It's crazy. But he is in mint condition. Quite awesome. I love this guy. And show you guys what he looks like in the background. Or comparing him to Wilson. And Wilson doesn't have barely anything on him. Oh my god. Wilson. Wilson. Also, just to let you guys know, I bought this 10-inch pop. And they're quite flimsy when you put them together. But they're from uh, Pop Shield Protectors. I'm not sure if it's the official company. Um, because I bought it uh, from eBay. But these things are like not as good as the 6-inch ones, to be honest. But they fit my 10-inch uh, one, uh, the Golden Deadpool. I never got to showcase him yet, but I, I will. I will. I just wanted to put him in the pop protector real quick. Okay, this is what he looks like in the pop protector. The pop protector is quite dirty, to be honest. But um, he does still look great in there. But the camera is actually making it look 10 times worse. But... It does have a quite bit of dust on the pop protector. Let me know if I should... Uh, um, it's only on the outside, actually, just to let you guys know, but just, um, just let me know how you guys clean a pop protector, and, um, yeah, just let me know. <laughs> but, this is what he looks like on the pop protector. He's fully protected, and the armor for it's pretty good. I'm not sure, I'm not gonna be doing a, uh, drop test, because I'm not gonna test that with this guy. But uh, if you guys want me to buy a 10-inch um, pop protector and try to buy like a common 10-inch, but I'm not sure if 10 inches come in commons, to be honest. But um, <laughs> I do want to test it. I really do. I see how strong this pop protector is compared to the 6-inch the ones. The 6-inch ones, actually, I have uh, seen them survive falls before, and it was quite awesome. Seeing pops getting uh surviving a fall from a high height is quite awesome. I wouldn't recommend dropping it from like uh probably it could survive probably this kind of fall for the six inch pop protectors, but I'm not sure about this how big this one is because the armor gets kind of soft in the front like here, and then kind of sometimes right here. But they do have some armor on the sides. You could feel it. <laughs> there he is. He is in his pop protector. He's giant. <laughs> He's giant. 